Hi guys, welcome to Yeti's Place. This is Yeti the Sammy Ed and I'm Yeti's mom and we'd like to welcome you to Yeti's Place today. So Yeti and I have fuzzy mice in our house. Ew. So what do you do when both your dog and you are afraid of mice in the house? Find out what happens up next on Yeti's Place. Before fall comes, where we are from in Wisconsin, the mice like to come into our house. And Yeti and I both do not like mice at all. He will jump up onto our bed and he'll cuddle with his dad and I, sending us out to look for those mice. I don't like looking for the mice at all, no. And Yeti is no help. So mice are able to fit into a hole the size of a dime, which is like, this big around, really, really, really tiny. They squish down and they fit into that little hole. So they're getting in through air vents, through the attic vents. They're, they're getting in from everywhere. And they are in our house. So we set up mouse traps. We have caught four mice, not Yeti, <laughs> but his dad and I did. I bait the trap and then my husband will set the trap and then I'll navigate where to put the trap got four so far and those four have been released in the garbage out in the great outdoors for the garbage truck the mice like to hang out in our basement I do the laundry in the basement and sometimes out of the corner of my eye I'll see something scoot around the floor yeah I know this is scary isn't it you don't like the mice neither do I Yeti sometimes comes down into the basement with me to help me do laundry and he'll lay down right by the laundry machine and Yeti will get scared and he'll start squeaking and everything if he sees a mouse running around. And then he'll race upstairs to, to hide from the mouse Yeti. So we've been placing mouse traps in those special places to catch those mice. And when we catch them, snap! Do you like this story? You like hearing about the mice catching, don't you? Yeah, because then you know that they're not in your house anymore. He likes the mice catching story, but not as much as he likes hearing about Quimby Bigby. Yes, I said their name, Quimby Bigby. I did. Yeah, you like seeing them. So what you do with mouse traps to catch those mice? Peanut butter. They do like peanut butter. So I take a little teeny tiny bit of peanut butter and I very strategically like wedge it into the, the trap area. You know that, that metal spring area that sits on the trap that has the, the snapper thing hooked onto it? That's where I put the, the peanut butter. You know, it's like where you put cheese, except peanut butter though, because it's sticky and sticks in there really well, the mice work and work and work at it, and while they're work, work, working at it, snap! Yeah! And the mice are gone. No more mice in the house. Yes! You wanna put the traps in a corner, against the wall, in a corner, with the, the bait side facing the wall. You don't want the bait side facing outside of the wall area because otherwise the mice can, Yeti, come here, come here. Yeti, look at this, okay. Because otherwise the mice come out and they, they get it and then there's plenty of space for them to run away. The mouse trap snaps shut, but there's not a mouse in that mouse trap. So you wanna make sure that there's a mouse in the mouse trap. We've tried Tootsie Rolls in the past too. And with the Tootsie Roll, you break a Tootsie Roll in half and then you squish the Tootsie Roll between your, your fingers. You know, you get it nice and, and warm and then you squish it, flatten it out, and then you stick it in there. Well, my husband ate the bag of Tootsie Rolls. And my husband is not a mouse, so that was a fail because I could not keep them away from him. So that is why we resorted to peanut butter, which works just as well. So we've got four mice so far. Yay! No mice in the house right now. But don't worry, they will be coming back again. So thank you so much, you guys, for joining us today. If you're new here, please be sure to subscribe and click that bell notification so you'll be notified of any new releases. And please also comment and like our video. Check out the links below. We'll see you next time. Bye.